Hello and welcome to Yoga Shorts. My name is Lola. I'm with the Sharon Forks Public Library, part of the Forsyth County Library System in Georgia. Inviting you to take a step away from the busyness of your day, to take a break for yourself, to move the body a little bit, take a couple of intentional breaths, hopefully move back into your day feeling relaxed or refreshed. So today we'll be doing um, standing poses. So always take care of yourself. If it hurts, don't do it. If you have any issues with the balance, you can always use a chair or um, stand close to a wall or even um, back up against a wall to, um, to do some of the postures that we're doing. So as I said, we'll be doing our standing poses. So we're gonna start in mountain pose, which is a firm standing foundation. And we're gonna just take a moment here to um, let go of the day, to set all the busyness aside and take a moment for ourselves. So find yourself in a comfortable standing position somewhere where hopefully you won't be interrupted for just a couple minutes and let your feet become a very firm foundation. Imagine that you're a mountain and your feet are firmly affixed to the ground. You can lift your toes up and put them back down. Reseat your heels. Imagine your feet have four corners and you're pressing down equally on all those corners. And then let your knees align above your ankles, your hips above your knees. And go ahead and take your shoulders up towards your ears just for a moment and let them settle back down again. And let your hands rest facing towards your, your legs today. So now that we've gotten our firm uh, mountain foundation, we're gonna just take a moment to notice our breath and to um, center in this spot for a minute. So if you're comfortable closing your eyes standing, go ahead and do that, not now. Otherwise, lower your gaze towards the ground, just soften your gaze. So first we're gonna, as we stand in our mountain pose, feel our feet. Notice how they are grounding us to the ground and also notice that your body is constantly making little um, adjustments to keep you upright. So imagine your attention travels up your legs, all the way up your back and check your posture. Make sure you're standing tall. You don't want the hips um, way out to the back or way up to the front. Just see if you can get them centered. Check in with those shoulders that we adjusted. See if they are more relaxed or can relax down a little bit. And check in with your jaw. Make sure you're not holding tension there. A quick scan of your face. Release any tension you might have been holding there today. And connect with your natural breath. Just notice that natural breath. Maybe it's the first time today you've really paid attention to it. Let me take a deep breath, a little bit deeper than normal. And let it go. We'll do that maybe two more times, a deep breath in, letting it go, and then see if you can make it a little bit deeper, and the exhale a little bit longer, and let your breath return to its natural rhythm. And go ahead and open your eyes or refocus your gaze. Check in with your mountain pose, see how it feels, You're still nice and sturdy. So first we're going to inhale and send our arms up overhead. Imagine that the sun is up there and you're saluting the sun. Hello sun. And then exhale, let the arms float back down. And we'll do that two more times. Inhale, stretching up with the upper half of the body. Imagine the lower half is still pressing into the ground. And exhale. So before we take our next breath, make a conscious effort to ground the lower part of the body. Maybe let the inside of the thighs turn in a little bit. Imagine those muscles working to ground your feet to the ground. And then inhale, let the upper body float up. And then exhale, the arms float down. So next we're gonna inhale on the arms, go back overhead. If your fingers can interlace comfortably, go ahead and do that. If not, you can leave them wide. 
and we're going to exhale to the right side, letting the left hip come out a little bit. The left side of the leg is firmly, um, is out there. The left foot is firmly on the ground. Inhale back up to center and exhale to the opposite side. So our crescent moon. Inhale to center and in the center, make sure that the bottom half is still grounded and the top half is floating high and exhale to the right. Inhale back up, exhale to the left, and we'll do one more to each side. So inhale back up and you can change your hand position, see how it feels, interlaced or not. Exhale to the right, inhale back up, and exhale to the left. Inhale up and exhale, unlace the fingers or let them float back down beside you. So we've moved into our, um, our mountain pose and our, um, our crescent moon from side to side. Let's take a wider stance with our legs right now. Whatever is comfortable for you, you may feel like you can send your feet out really wide. Just make sure that you have a, still have a firm foundation as you set your feet down. Let your feet be parallel to one another as much as is comfortable um, based on your hips and the way that your body aligns. So we're going to inhale our arms up into star pose and exhale into this position. Inhale and reach with both sets of fingers on either side. See if you can get your star sparkling on the fingers, pressing down with the feet, exhaling here, inhaling, See if your gaze can be straight ahead. Nice and solid star pose. Exhale, inhale and imagine that your chest is open a little bit and not too far with the arms back, but just maybe a little more than as you stand naturally. And exhale here. One more inhale, reaching, reaching, pressing with the feet. And then on the exhale, let the arms come down, let the feet step back together again. So we've moved into our star pose, stretching open the front body. So now we're going to move back into the star pose, but keep the feet a little bit closer together this time. And again, see if they can be parallel to one another. And we're going to move into tipping our star pose. So it's a little bit of a balance. So this is where you might want to grab a wall or a chair, or maybe not even let the foot come off the ground. So we're going to first lean to the right side. So have our arms back up in star. Our legs aren't quite as far apart. Start to press up with the left foot so you're standing on the toe. The weight is shifting to the right. If you feel comfortable lifting that left foot off the ground, go ahead and do that. If not, keep the toe touching down on the ground. And here's your side balance pose, your star pose. Take a breath here. And then come back down to center. And then we'll switch sides. Weight shifts a little bit to the left. Right toe is touching down. Or if it feels comfortable, you can lift that right foot off the ground in your tip star pose. Balance. Always watch your balance. Keep that toe down if that feels comfortable or grab a chair or a wall. And then exhale back down to center. Let those arms come down. Shake the arms out a little bit and shake each leg out a little bit. And let all that go. And let's take a nice deep breath in the center position again in our mountain position. Nice big inhale and exhale. Maybe one more because it feels really good. And let that go. So that's all for us today, but we've done our standing postures and gotten some good breath movement going and even done a little bit of balance um, with, our, with our star pose. So give these a try if you'd like. Try it against a wall um, or a chair, whatever feels most comfortable to you. Um, but this is a combination of our strong foundation and then moving into our balanced pose. So I do hope this continues to find you doing well. Um, take care of yourself. Remember to take some time out from your busy day, um, whatever season it is, to take a breath and just give yourself a minute to rest. Take care. I look forward to seeing you next time.